Megan the Duchess of Sussex to donate damages from tabloid case against the Daily Fail to an anti-bullying charity. Hello, my name is Brian and welcome back to Sussex Squad Family TV on YouTube. Kindly like and subscribe. Why? For daily and consistent content. Daily and consistent content on YouTube. Now, the latest news is that the Mail on Sunday has agreed to pay for infringing Megan's copyright and invading her privacy. The money for copyright will be in the millions. And you can call her Megan the Money because she's making a lot, a lot of millions from the Daily Fail. As you can remember, the Daily Fail lost its case after publishing large portions of a private letter she sent to Thomas Markle. And so, with that, the Daily Fail has agreed to pay the Duchess of Sussex a significant amount in damages in the millions. Now, the court documents that we have seen show that associated newspapers will hand over an unspecified amount, an unspecified amount estimated to be worth millions, millions and millions. Let that be very, very, very clear. For infringing our Queen Megan's copyright of the letter, after they put the handwritten note on the front page of the mail on Sunday, violating Megan's privacy and copyright. And in several mail online articles in 2018, a small sum of one pound, that is $1.36, will also be transferred to Megan for invading her privacy. A nominal sum that was agreed listen very clearly, agreed on by both parties to avoid a lengthy argument over the extent of damages the Duchess of Sussex has suffered. Now, in March of 2021, a British High Court judge also ordered the tabloid publisher to cover a large portion of of Megan's legal costs, which are now believed to be more than $2 million. So make no mistake about one thing. Megan will not only make millions, a lot, a lot of millions, from copyright infringement by the Daily Fail. The Daily Fail will pay her millions. But in addition to that, the Daily Fail will also have already, they have already paid Megan more than two million dollars worth of legal fees. Now let's hear her words directly from the spokesperson for Megan, the Duchess of Sussex. Now, a spokesperson for the Duchess confirms that the payout for copyright infringement is substantial. Let not the daily fail ever lie to you. Let them not lie to you they have paid a fortune they have paid megan a fortune a fortune a fortune and megan has humiliated the daily fail make no mistake whatsoever about that and megan has said that the proceeds will be donated to an anti-bullying charity in due cause and you know, I'm so proud of this woman. I'm proud of Megan. Megan is an inspiration to every single person, every single woman who has suffered injustice as the hand of the UK tabloids. All of them, they all now look up to Megan, Duchess of Sussex. The woman, a mother to Archie and little bit Diana, a superhero who stood up to one of the most bigoted papers in the UK, the Daily Mail, and Megan won. She won against the Daily Mail. And nothing, nothing, no amount of lies, no amount of smear campaign will ever change the fact that the Daily Fail lost to a beautiful 
mixed race woman. A beautiful and smart inside and out. Now, as part of the court settlement that has been revealed today, January 5th, all male outlets have also been ordered to never ever disclose the name of Megan's five friends who anonymously spoke to People magazine for a 2019 cover feature about the royal. Last year, the publisher made it clear it wanted to name the individuals, again invading the privacy of other people once again of Megan's five friends. And that's, that's the Daily Mail behavior. That's how the Daily Mail behaves. And as Megan once said, today it's Megan, but tomorrow it could be you. This case is not about just Megan. It's about every single person who has ever suffered an injustice by the Daily Fail. To never ever let an injustice slide because of intimidation, deception, and attacks. Megan took them on and she won. She won. And now every single other person who lives in the UK can now look up to Megan. Now, the news follows the Mail on Sunday and Mail Online carrying court-ordered front-page and home-page legal notices alongside a short report of the summary judgment, which was delivered to the paper by Judge Wabi. The publisher had hoped the news would fly under the radar by publishing on December 26, one of the quietest newspaper buying days on the British calendar. On the British calendar, but Sussex supporters, nicknamed the Sussex Squad family, quickly turned Meghan Markle one into a trending hashtag worldwide. Humiliating for the Daily Fail. Very humiliating. Now, in December, Associated Newspaper lost an appeal to have the case reopened and taken to trial after a panel of three judges at the Court of Appeal concluded that Megan had a reasonable expectation of privacy regarding the contents of the letter to Thomas Markle. And Megan did not just win once. She won twice, two times against the Daily Fail owned by Lord Rothermere. And Prince Harry will be taking on Rupert Murdoch this year over phone hacking claims. And I will cover every single moment of it. Looking for this beautiful family to continue being blessed, to continue thriving, to continue being happy. As they continue fighting against injustice, we will be there to support Prince Harry and Meghan every single step of the way. And following her double win, the Duchess of Sussex called it a victory, not just for me, but for anyone who has ever felt scared to stand up for what's right. Calling out the male's harmful practice, she added, the courts have held the defendant, Lord Rothermere, we must mention his name, to account, and my hope is that we all begin to do the same. But I can never forget saying this, I will always say one thing. Megan did not just win against the Daily Fail. She won also against the palace itself. Megan is a queen, a queen and a queen, and she's a superhero. She has won, and she keeps on winning, and she will stay winning every single time. Make no mistake whatsoever. Remember Jason North, who Prince William asked, to issue a statement helping the Daily Fail against Megan. Remember him? Yes, we do remember and we must never ever forget. And Megan didn't just win against the Daily Fail. She won against the palace itself. With so much love from Sussex Squad Family TV, thank you once again for joining us. And that's the full story. Now, Kindly like, subscribe for daily and consistent content. Keyword daily. Stay tuned to our next video and hit that like and subscribe button. Love you, my family. Hello, 
Sussex Squad Family TV on YouTube. I hope you enjoyed our video podcast today. Kindly like, subscribe and leave a comment below. Your support means the absolute world to us. Please like, like and subscribe. Help us grow our family on YouTube. Stay tuned for our next video.